Oil down nearly $8 in less than a week. And you know what? It's still too expensive. Time for a little insight and action. Let me show you why. All right? Very simple. Oil has a problem. Look at oil, coal, and gas, all priced in dollars per million BTUs. The price it costs to get energy out of all these different sources of energy. Look up here where oil is, all right? Over $20 per million BTUs versus, look at that, nat gas, as we well know, at about three and a half dollars. Coal even cheaper than that. Look at this differential, all right? That's where we are right now. Look what happened the last time you had that differential so wide. The best way to think about this is as follows. Your utility, you can use oil, coal, nat gas to create electricity in your plant. It's not as easy as just flipping a switch, but suffice to say you have the choice. With oil this expensive, you're not going to be using oil. You're going to be going to coal and natural gas. Think about it that way, and you begin to understand why that arbitrage ultimately comes down. Look what happened the last time. Came down hard. All right, so that's from the team over at Bernstein, and we thank them for that insight. Meanwhile, as the team at Jeffries points out, it's not just oil that has a problem. It's the drillers that have a problem. Natural gas assets are already weak. That weakness spreading to oil for the reason we just showed you, that, that price uh, arbitrage collapses. And here's the key. The leverage drillers are especially vulnerable. What you may or may not realize is a lot of the drillers issue bonds in order to pay for all their drilling exploits, all right? So when you have uh, asset prices that are coming down, it means that they get squeezed on the bond payments, all right, and their cash flow and what they're able to borrow. Look at this. Net debt to cash flow, says the team over at Jefferies. Exco, Forest Oil, Swift, and Chesapeake, especially vulnerable given that the average net debt to cash flow is two and a half times. Look at that, 4.9 times for Exco. That's the concern, Trish. You get squeezed as prices come down.